What's good everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going over cheap alternatives to dress like Justin Bieber. No, I have no shame in saying that I like the way Justin Bieber dresses. I think his fashion sense is very nice. So let's go ahead and get into it. I previously did a video on how to layer like Justin Bieber and that video did really well and a lot of you guys asked for another video going over something with Justin Bieber. So I decided to come on here and give you a few pieces that are cheaper alternatives to things that he wears because a lot of the stuff that he wears is very expensive. So I wanna show you how to do that on a budget. Before we get started on this video, if you enjoy it, please leave a like down below and subscribe here if you are new. I post all kinds of streetwear content. But basically, I know there's probably gonna be a little bit of hate on this video. A lot of people don't like how Justin Bieber dresses. I know he's not the one to originate this style, but he's one of the icons that wears kind of that style now. So I decided to do a video on just him. Basically, Justin Bieber wears a lot of fear of God. He wears some Supreme and stuff here and there, but mainly he wears fear of God and he has a lot of clothing inspired by fear of God with his collaborations like these shirts right here his purpose tour shirts he's had a ton of them with different companies like PacSun they've come out with forever 21 all kinds of different companies with that being said I'm basically just gonna go over more of the fear of God style and some of the clothes that you can get for a cheaper alternative but focus it mainly on him because he's the one that brought all these styles together let's go ahead and start with the shirts so Justin Bieber has been known to wear a lot of fear of God vintage t-shirts and he wears them oversized. He wears them sometimes layered and sometimes not. It seems more recently he hasn't been wearing them more with layering, but I've got some options for you so you can layer them if you want to. As far as vintage rock shirts go, you can go to Goodwill. I got this one on eBay right here for $10. All you have to do is type in vintage rock shirt and look for something between 10 and 15 bucks, and it's a good alternative. I like to go with the actual vintage shirts more just because they have the faded look, which looks a lot better than that brand new t-shirt in my opinion. But there's a bunch of different alternatives you can do for this. This is just one of them. I picked up both of these shirts from Goodwill right here. We've got a Metallica 2003 tour shirt and also a Power Rangers vintage shirt. Three bucks a piece and you can't go wrong. The reason I say vintage rock shirt is because Fear of God has come out with their own collection of these vintage rock shirts that go anywhere from $1,000 to $1,500 just because they're very limited and very vintage. So I decided to go ahead and give you guys some alternatives that are less than $10 if you can find the right deal. As far as layering goes, you can check on my other video if you want specifics, but I basically have an H&M long line tee right here that goes for $10. I'm six foot two and this is a size medium if you're curious to what I wear. You can go ahead and throw this under an oversized shirt if you want that layering look. Next, let's move on to the pants. So he really only wears his fear of God denim that I see all the time. So I've got an alternative to that that I want to show you guys. It is from Hyper Denim. The specific jean that I'm showing you is the Hyper Denim Muffa Zipper Denim. Justin Bieber wears a lot of zipper denim pants. Basically, that's all he wears nowadays. These have a great alternative right here. They've got the zippers there. They've got the similar distressing where it's got two nice holes around the knees. It also has a distressing on the upper thigh. These go for about $60 to $65 from Hyper Denim. So it's a good alternative to that $1,500 or $1,000 price point of fear of God. Another thing is the wash in the denim kind of varies a lot. I've been seeing him sticking to that lighter wash and he also has one that's kind of bleached or kind of like an acid wash. So this is a perfect alternative. Another pant that I see him wear are the fear of God drawstring trousers that are in this tan color right here. Those are a little bit more expensive as well and this is a cheap alternative from EPTM. They have that drawstring from that fear of God look. They're also extended length so they give a nice stacking around the ankles. Only thing is they do not have a zipper on the inside ankle, but EPTM does offer an alternative with that zipper. These go for about 55 bucks, so you can't go wrong. If you've been following Beaver lately, you've seen him wearing his Purpose Tour camo jacket. I have an alternative right here from Zara. That Purpose Tour jacket is not too expensive. It's 150 bucks, but if you don't want that Purpose Tour branding on the back, you just want a plain jacket like this, go ahead and pick this up from Zara for 90 bucks. You're saving about 60 bucks, and it's that oversized fit. That is a big thing that he likes to wear is an oversized fit. So go ahead and check these out. I wear a size small and it is definitely very oversized. Before I go onto the shoes, one of the alternatives I'm wearing right now is on my head. This is a hat that is inspired by the James Purse trucker hat. This one was $9 from eBay. It has that wool look. I think it is a really good alternative because it is only $9. I'll link the listings down below if you wanna go ahead and check it out. The James Purse hat goes for about 80 bucks, but you can't buy it anymore. So I thought this was a good alternative. Lastly, moving on to the pair of shoes. This one's gonna be kind of iffy because he wears so many pairs of shoes. But the one shoe that I've seen him wear that is very affordable is these Vans checkered slip-ons right here, which go for $55. 
He wears these a lot and they go well with all of the things that I've shown here. I wear these shoes with them all the time and they're very cheap. You can beat them up if you want to and you can get a replacement pair if you want to because they're in that cheaper price point. He also has been seen wearing all of these shoes, the Fear of God Vans, the Oxford Tan Yeezys, the Fear of God Skate Highs. He's been seen wearing all of these, but these are all at a higher price point. And I didn't think I wanted to include them because they resell for a lot and it's hard to get them. So I wanted to get something that is obtainable for you guys. These ones are selling for about 225 bucks. These go for, I don't know, $700 to $800. And then these are going for about 300 to $400. So if you want to have any of these options, if you've got a little bit of money, you can check these out and he has worn all of these. One bonus alternative that I'll throw in is this bandana right here. He wears bandanas all the time at all of his shows. I got this one from Michaels about a year ago. I included it in my video last week. It's about $2, I'll link it down below. You can get any color that you want. I just went with black because it's pretty simple and I think it goes well. So that's gonna wrap it up for cheaper alternatives to dress like Justin Bieber. I hope you guys did enjoy and this was helpful in any way. If you did, please smash that thumbs up button down below. Subscribe here if you're new. I post a video every single Sunday and every single Thursday. I'll see you guys next time. This is Harrison, signing out. That girl is a real